No, I'm always like this. It's just I can reel it in when we get started. Greetings, Internet. It is I, the Devil's Advocado, and this is Evil Guacamole Gaming, and I am joined by one of my fellow hosts and one of uh, our favorite guests. I'll start with my fellow host. That's you, Josh. Oh! <laughs> you have an Never. actual guac name. That makes you a fellow host. I didn't know. I was so confused for a moment. I was like... Me of all people? Well, hello there, Internet. <laughs> I am Professor Pepper, PhD to your darkest dreams. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, our one of our favorite lovely guests. Aww. I am Coco from Pixel Coco. And uh, we are playing the beta for Talk to Me. I sent out a. Uh, uh, thing to the Yaoi Game Jam saying, hey, if people want me, uh, want Evil Guacamole Gaming to test out their games, especially since we've got the, a lot of the non-heteronormative folk uh, on the team, I would be happy to do so. And this is one of the games that got uh, suggested to me from one of the people participating. This is not a full-on Yaoi game. Uh, this is a, it's got a male protagonist uh, with possible relations with uh, men and women uh, and I'm not sure like how much like the relationships go I saw something about with the Kickstarter which it's just being kickstarted currently so you know support them uh, I saw something about the 18 plus art something so I guess maybe it must go a little bit more than than, than friendly <laughs> boop, uh, boop, 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 butt sex <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I'm not sure if that's the the where they're going it may well, be well, tasteful it, it may be tasteful but in any of one of these relationships that's going on it's a possibility your main protagonist is a male and Everyone has butts. This is <laughs> this is true, as far as we know. Oh God, they aren't born with anuses. Those poor souls. They you, just explode. You know the weird thing is, like that feels like one of those. That's not what I was intending with what I said, but it kind of was. It's just <laughs> just ridiculous. <laughs> so we're gonna start it. Uh, start, and uh, here we go. I am in a library. I thought it said I am library for a second. That's I was like, I oh. To. <laughs> I am library. I am. Hear me roar. Read my books. Touch my binding. Oh. How Stroke delicate. my pages. Can <laughs> I see your index? <laughs> That's good. Ooh. Ooh. Young adult. Um. <laughs> My name is Ordell Harrison, and I am good at libraries. <laughs> and I am good at curry. I'm not very good at anything else. Aww. Aww. Well, at least you know the Dewey Decimal System, you dumb. <laughs> Don't you know the Dewey Decimal System? Um. And that is exactly the problem. You know, uh, as a couch side uh, the, the psychiatrist or whatnot, um, the, an unprofessional psychiatrist uh, I have to say I'm suspecting that that is not the only or exact problem yeah I'm Just going lately. to go with the fact that he's being completely melodramatic <laughs> yeah. and he needs to um, toughen up a little bit and explore the world <laughs> And it doesn't matter where those fingers go, as long as they're no longer in the outside world. Uh... Frankly, I am disappoint- Uh, I am a disappointment. I really wanted to, to just be, frankly, I am disappoint. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I moved away to get a job and maybe start a family. So mm -hmm. far, I am zero for two. Aww. <laughs> I live in a modest apartment, which I pay for with my inheritance. Well, at least he got lucky with money. I mean, I have to work for a living. You know how many hours <laughs> I have to stand out by the train tracks just to get a few bucks? <laughs> Doctors that... only pay so well. <laughs> well, professors. <laughs> sorry. Professors only pay so well, especially when they're seasoning. I can't get that many jobs. Uh, I can barely remember my mom. Ah, that... Harsh. I'm so sorry, Belle. <laughs> uh, I I am horrible when it comes to remembering important stuff, but if you ask me about something nobody gives a damn about, like her social security number, I promise I, I won't have a problem recalling that. I think a lot of people would be interested to know that information. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's... And he's like, it's I mean, not just, important. Just tell me her birthday, too. That's all I need. Yeah, um... What's her maiden name and what's her blood type? What what <laughs> what is her banking routing number? And <laughs> so I get in on that inheritance. <laughs> I, no I no mean, no no! I'm not asking for any particular reason. Just curious. Yeah. I love. I'm digging the background music though. It kind of reminds me of like a um, RPG Final Fantasy esque. You're getting ready to go to the final boss area, but somebody died, so you have to stop and like mourn them. <laughs> so I think we're mourning his um, like manhood right now because he's going to go into adulthood, and we're just sitting here crying and weeping for this sad soul that is probably still a virgin. Virginity is a myth. We've gone over this. Uh, on um, well, other Let's Plays. Well, it may be a myth, but, I mean, unicorns are a myth, and I'm sad that they died, too, so... <laughs> uh, fair enough. Uh, <laughs> I know that she wanted a grandchild. Well, if you go the gay option, you're pretty much screwed unless you got adoption. Yeah, adoption probably would work. Like, artificial she can't... Ordell can't remember much about Mom... Uh, knows about wanting grandchild, he can just assume that that gay is fine and that that you know that adoption is perfectly acceptable. I mean, you could also go with the uh, thirteen Smirnoffs, a turkey baster, and a weird night of whatever, and boom, grandchild nine months later. <laughs> or, or you could marry somebody that is bi that already has a kid. Yeah, there you go. So, or wasn't, was never by, but had a phase and accidentally knocked somebody up because they, they were trying to act like they weren't, they weren't gay. <laughs> this, this actually happens a lot. This is, this oh, is. Oh, I know. <laughs> I, I was lucky. I didn't have to go through that. I'm like, nah, I'm good. I don't want no kids. I hate them. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of it has like to do with, with, with people take ri riskier behaviors if they're not able to identify their actual sexuality um, and and so they, they 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 experiment in unsafe ways to try to understand themselves better and um, then kids yeah the riskiest behavior I'm willing to interact with right now is eating a peanut butter sandwich while walking up the stairs <laughs> that's risky enough for me I'm good Hey, that that can get tricky, especially if the peanut butter stick into the roof of your mouth. Oh man! I know it gets. That's super right. Crazy. We have a game to get back to. It's too late for her, but maybe it's not too late for me. Hey, she would still be a grandmother, just not alive. Like, oh. you know. Like maybe my, my grandfather is still my grandfather, even though, you know, he's dead. Um. <laughs> He, and he's still my my daughter's great grandfather, even though he wasn't alive when she was born. So I don't really this, but this this goes to show that Ordell is not handling anything really healthily. Yeah, he he really should actually start reading some of these books. Yeah, specifically uh, the kind that are around the psychiatric section, which I'm assuming is probably upstairs. Well, no, you, we've got the, um, 
Dewey Decimal happening here. See, 700, oh, yeah. 800? Yeah, it's on the first floor. Oh, um, well, I thought it might just be on the second floor, you know, in one of those could drawers. Be. Because he can't find it, apparently, so. <laughs> Maybe he's not good at library. <laughs> no, he's probably not. <laughs> uh, it's a little bit embarrassing to admit, but it's been years since I've been intimate with someone. Oh, oh then, yeah, he's not a virgin. Yeah. My whole theory is ruined. Yeah. <laughs> We're I mean, mourning his overdramaticness right now, then. We're mourning his his ability to handle life in a healthy manner. Um, <laughs> yeah. uh, maybe I still have some time. Yes, you're alive. You, do you have the cancer or something? No. Unless you still do. Have some time left. You're like <laughs> 20 at most. Calm down. Since I know the game designer is probably watching this, like... Like, I, I actually like how this is being introduced, because this is... The reason why we're giving so much shit to Ordell is because we've all interacted with this person, and probably all three of us have been this person. Hey, I have never been this person. Uh, within <laughs> recent years. I... <laughs> within recent years, yes, exactly. <laughs> we we all have had our, our point where we were very much like this. Um... And so, what we're really doing is laughing at ourselves. Um, I've always been a happy-go-lucky, pessimistic ball of hatred. What are you talking about? <laughs> that that actually is a fairly accurate description of you that I've always known in the <laughs> the almost ten years I've known you. Uh, <laughs> uh, but I always assumed that that only happened because because you had some period of time where you were like this and then you got over it not really no i didn't have this period until after college yeah i was just literally was. always a happy-go-lucky pessimistic ball of hatred <laughs> was it the walmart that caused this uh no because i didn't work there till after that too if walmart just exacerbated that like to the nth degree i'm like oh no 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 now i really <laughs> hate you <laughs> Every time I see some of my coworkers, I'm like, "Oh my god, you're still alive!" Is that a, a, a like, disbelief or or disheartening? Uh, disheartening, and the fact that I'm like, "Oh, nobody hired an assassin for you yet." <laughs> uh, I should at least try. Yes, yes, please try, Ordell. I mean, I guess there's nothing to lose. Yes. Yes, Ordell. Well, I don't know. According uh, I mean, to the I internet, people get of... super crazy sometimes, so you may lose your life from a stabbing or a mugging or something. You might want to be careful. Yeah, so I think you maybe should prioritize other things first before thinking about relationships. But that's that's true. But, I mean, Ordell doesn't need a relationship. But engaging and trying to get a relationship may help him normalize his life enough that he can kind of do and be, you know? And the yeah. immortal I mean, like, words of... Talking... <laughs> huh? Uh, like, talking with other people, yeah, that's all good, but considering what he was just talking about, it seems like he is specifically talking about finding someone to settle down with. Yeah, I, I, I hope he doesn't actually settle down until, like, the stuff gets settled but like i i would encourage somebody at this point that like like if you're interested in other people like you're 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 non-asexual uh then you know go out and try it doesn't mean like you don't need to succeed for it to be a good experience of you know uh, building yourself up in in some way, uh, mm -hmm. um, and I mean, but there are several people in front of me. Most I would never ever even dare to talk to. It, oh, that that's <laughs> beggars choose. No, I'm <laughs> like I I have a feeling that the the I wouldn't dare to talk to is because of fear, not not because they're beneath. 
Beneath yeah, him. I, I was really hoping yeah. it was more like he was like going into like a candy shop and he was like, oh, I would never ever eat any of this. I am on a diet, <laughs> strictly no carbs. <laughs> then why are you in here? Uh, oh, I just wanted to complain. <laughs> I like complaining. I really do. I really, really do. But today is going to be different. Yeah, because it's not yesterday. <clears throat> but uh, that, uh, and also, it, that's just generally true. I'll just have to pick up all the courage I have left. Did you drop it? <laughs> I start looking around for someone I can approach. I, you know, actually, like, don't just immediately decide this and then, like, like, okay, I'm going to find somebody that I can start having a relationship with. I, wherever I am currently, I'm just going to find a person. <laughs> like, the, I'm going to be a hungry hyena on the prowl. The first thing I see, I'm going to pounce on it, start licking its face, and be like, we're dating now. What up, yo? <laughs> mm, Man, woo me over. Ah. <laughs> uh, but this actually is a comfort zone, so this might not be bad. Especially if there's social activities happening at this library with the depressing lighting. Am I uh, the only person that noticed the purpose <laughs> and the Gemini symbols in the window? Oh, yeah. This is where... <laughs> this is to help with dating. This is where you sit for your sign and like all yeah. the people that believe in like the 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 connection is like oh i need a gemini oh look there's a bunch <laughs> of gemini's i'm sure that they're loyal and 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 well, i don't know i have no idea yeah, but but... no you didn't <laughs> uh the library is full of people no not... no it's not sweetie look it's empty <laughs> Say, I mean, unless, <laughs> unless this is the Beast's castle and all these chairs are people, <laughs> or he's crazy. <laughs> or this is just the suspension of disbelief necessary for visual novels. <laughs> uh, girl in the corner of the room is checking her phone. She's dressed in a black uniform. She may be a waitress or something. Her hair is black, too. There's a smile on her face. She seems nice. Oh god, that's Samara. Don't she... talk to her. She'll eat you through the telephones. <laughs> she could be looking at pictures of people being tortured on her phone and, and smiling about it. Or she's just checking out dick pics from Tinder. <laughs> <laughs> this is crooked. <laughs> um, that's... That's a curve. Um... <laughs> <laughs> um, a redhead is sitting behind a computer nearby. She's laughing. Her eyes are so light and green, I can see them shine from where I'm sitting. She is blind. She's a laser beam. <laughs> <laughs> She's blind. They are, they are only slightly green. Those are cataracts. She's got glaucoma and she's high as balls. <laughs> 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 Not everyone with glaucoma is is high as balls. No, but she's in a library and she's laughing. If you high if balls. you are are uh, have glaucoma or are as high or are high as balls, like, comment, and subscribe, and tell us if you're the other one as well. <laughs> um, and or either way. And if you're not, also like, comment, and subscribe because that helps us grow the channel. Uh, <laughs> a redhead is sitting behind a computer. A brunette reads a book next to her. The book she's reading is a thick volume about physics. Ooh, the thick. last girl seems to be a suitable candidate. <laughs> uh, the, to be a suitable candidate is a pretty blonde. She is wearing a denim jacket and a short skirt. She is quite obviously looking around. Just like me, she seems to be looking for someone. Yeah, this is starting to sound more like a sacrificial thing than a date. <laughs> she seems like yeah. a suitable candidate. She doesn't <laughs> seem like she'd put up much of a fight. <laughs> she has the qualities necessary. She is blonde hair. Blonde. Weak legs, <laughs> enough hair to grab... Um, well, actually, you know, that still sounds sex. Uh, I was trying to make it sound more like... 
uh, a cultish sacrifice. It just sounded more like sex stuff. Uh, I'm going to talk to... Ah. Hmm. The laughing this red. Is, this is, this is going to be a tough choice. This is choice. Ooh, what? This is crazy. Um, actually, since we did a lot of chatting, we're over 20 minutes now. I think we'll uh, end the episode here. <laughs> We've not accomplished a lot, but uh, that's okay. Well, I'm involved. You knew that wasn't going to happen. I'm a massive distraction. <laughs> uh, this has been Evil Guacamole Gaming, and thank you for joining us. Uh, farewell. Toodaloo! Blah, 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 blah. My life's sad. <laughs>